Hey boys, it's Arm9. Today, I'm back in Grand Theft Auto Online for yet another customization battle with my friends NPC and Twingo. If you didn't see last week's customization battle, it was on the Dubachi Masakro. So before we get into today's, we have to go over the voting totals from last week. But of course, in today's customization battle, we are customizing the Banshee 900R. So that should be really exciting. I believe Twingo has the voting totals, so he's gonna read them off in just a second. Let's hear it. Who is All our right. loser for today? The vote totals, let me pull them up. Oh boy. Oh dear. All right, oh here we go. With the points from the race counted in, that's 10 for best lap and 25 because NPC won and got best lap. He took 25 away from me. So with that all totaled into the votes, first place still goes to V-Twidge with 370. <laughs> what? Let's go. What? Oh yeah. What? Harm none. Actually, no. Actually, yes. Harm none gets second with yes! 370. No. no. And NPC comes very close behind with 35 bonus points at 254. Oh my oh god. Oh my god. I thought I lost. Yeah. I actually was really sure that I lost. I thought close. it was. I thought Harm none was gonna win. I thought Harm none was gonna win. Like, oh my god. Big Red pulled through this time. Yeah. 360 of you guys are insane. <laughs> what the f I'm sorry. This has got to be one of the ugliest massacres I've ever seen. Damn. Really? But, Damn. Yeah. NPC is such it's a toxic so friend. Loud. Oh my not god. My style. I can't. You're, kicked out. you're, so, kicking you're out so mean to Twingo. You cannot say that. I cannot. I'm 0 for 3 on pulling like votes from people. That's, that's, that's unfortunate. That's so smarter, insane. buddy. That's insane. How? I, do, I just don't understand. Oh my god. Uh... <laughs> that was so brutal. <laughs> Jesus Deserve every bit Christ. for that comment. Yeah, valid. I mean, I, I, if, I if, sold my car. If I had just god. said to you what NPC said, everybody would be calling me a toxic friend and telling me I shouldn't be friends with you guys anymore. <laughs> or telling you guys that you shouldn't be friends with me. I get comments like that way too often. And they're out for you, Ben. Yeah. Nobody understands that it's it's for the meme, and it's not really a serious thing. I don't actually yeah, hate my friends, believe it I'm or not. Still, I'm He's still here recording, really am I not? Yeah. I talked to Harm None several times a week. They only talk to you because you're the bigger channel. He's actually got a gun to my head. Yeah. He's forcing I, me to play. The sniper all the way outside from, of NPC's window. Yeah, even though I'm all the way, like... How many hours am I away from you? Like by car, probably uh, like ten. Oh, longer, probably like. Well, 12, if you're 16. hauling ass, I don't know. Probably like sixteen. Yeah. He's actually hired my roommate to uh, make sure to execute me if I didn't hop on. That's right. Cole knows. <laughs> All right. Uh, All right let's grab this, these banshees. This is my car, correct? Okay, it is. All right. Well, I'm gonna head over to Benny's. All right. All right. Get over here, buddy. Yeah, where is I'm NPEC? so excited for oh this right now. Gosh. Oh, oh gosh. yeah, first place. Let's go. I hate you. Yeah, that's right, buddy. That's what? right. It just doesn't open for me. Good. That's this, It's rigged. This is exactly rigged. what you deserve. <laughs> All right, boys, here we are. Let's go ahead and upgrade this uh, to Benny's 565. Let's go ahead and throw that on. Beautiful. I like it. Okay. Uh, we're going to go ahead and start off with the armor upgrade, followed by the race brakes. we got to put that on. Um, I'm actually just going to go through and do everything performance quickly so that we can kind of focus on the actual customization. So slam it down. Uh, we will do the transmission. We'll do the turbo as well. God knows we need all of that stuff. And um, okay, let's go ahead and begin. So with the front bumpers, we do have a few different options here. Uh, this one just adds the bolts onto the fender. Uh, so that is cool. Got the classic RS bumper, drift RS, GT bumper, and the street SPL. Now, do I want to go for a track build here? I'm kind of thinking that I do. Um, and I feel like the street SPL is quite a cool bumper. 
I think I do want to make like a race car. I haven't really gone for like a race car build for a while. So let's go street SPL for right now. For the engine block, we can change up the color of the valve covers. Let's go carbon on the valve covers, actually, I think. Ooh, actually, you know what? Stock's kind of cool because it's got the battery there, but... Oh, it still does. It's just different, different connection. Okay, uh, carbon valve covers. We'll go for that. For the strut brace, we're going to go for a titanium one. Let's go for the wide titanium. I like the look of that. For the exhaust, we have the dual exit exhaust, the race exhaust, the chrome tip, the twin carbon can and the cannons. The cannons are really cool. I do think that I kind of want the chrome tip exhaust because it's a single exit and I think that looks a little bit better, honestly. So let's do that. For the arches, we can go rivetless or we can go for carbon rear arches. Let's go rivetless, I think. So let's do that. For the hood, we have quite a few different options here. Um, honestly, the, ooh, not the bolt-on arches. The smooth hood is pretty sick looking. The air filters are kind of cool. Um, at the same time, I think that I kind of like the vented hood. I do like the vented hood quite a lot. We're going to go for the vented hood. I, I, I think that's the best look for that. So let's do that. Uh, bobbleheads. I don't think that I'm actually going to go for one today because I don't think it's really going to fit with the race car sort of theme. So we'll leave that alone. We will go for a carbon dash and stripped interior. For the door cards. I could change them. I do kind of like having the stock door cards. I'm not gonna lie, but if we are going race car, then well, we need to. We need to have the uh, we need to have the carbon. So let's go carbon door cards for the seats. Let's go something carbon. Maybe carbon tuner seats. That sounds pretty good. For the wheel, um, now I do believe this thing is a manual. So maybe I don't want to go for something that has paddle shifters. I probably don't. I don't want to get roasted for that. So uh, maybe just the rally basic. I kind of like the look of that. That's cool. Light color on the dash. Karina red. Let's do, let's do that. I think that's I think that's cool. For the lights, we can go xenon. I think I have an idea actually. I'm gonna leave that alone. We will go for the front, back, and side neon kit. We're gonna leave that white. I'm not gonna change the color of it, obviously. Uh, for the livery, we have the black 900R power stripe. We have that in white as well. We have the stoplight racer graphics. We have the black flash, yellow flash. Black two-tone Bravado Racing Retro Stripes. That's really cool. And the camo. I'm going to go for the Bravado Racing Retro Stripes. I like that livery a lot, actually. That's really, really cool. It's like kind of retro looking. I, I really, I really do like that. Uh, we will go SA Exempt because it's a race car. So we'll do that. For the color of the car. Hmm. Maybe I don't go with this livery. I feel like the, I feel like it's really hard to match anything up with it. Let's go. Okay, let's go Harbor Blue for the primary and the secondary color. Let's throw that on just real quick. Trim color on the inside. Oh, that does some of the little instrument clusters there and stuff. So uh, let's look at the livery options now that we've got it in Harbor Blue. The white 900R power stripe actually looks really good on this, I have to say. The stoplight racer is also pretty cool. You know what? That might be the livery. Honestly, that might be the livery. Um, Yellow Flash is also really cool. So is Black Flash. Black Two-Tone. I do like the Bravado Retro Stripes. I feel like that is a really cool option. I think I'm going to keep it for right now. Uh, for the roof, we can remove it. I'm going to keep it on, though, obviously. For the skirts, uh, we can do some custom skirts that join in the fender a little bit better. I do like that option, so we're probably going to go for something like that. Uh, we have the street skirts as well, which actually are really really cool so we'll probably go for the street or the uh no sorry the sport skirts the sport skirts those are really sick let's go for that option for the spoiler oh that adds some more blue i do like it i do like it a lot okay the tarmac attack wing as well we do have i feel like the high level spoiler is a really cool option and i like that it's in that blue i think that looks really really sick so I'm very happy with that. Okay, we can go for a smoothed rear deck lid if we want to, which removes that ducktail. I actually almost like removing it, but at the same time, I do really like that line that comes up around the edge of the car there. I think that is really cool looking. So there is that option. We have the bolt-on deck lid as well. Um, that's kind of cool. The smoothed carbon deck lid. And then we, of course, have the full carbon deck lid and the panels. This is a really hard call, honestly. I kind of think stock is maybe the best thing to do or remove the um, stock ducktail. 
I feel like I like it though. I feel like I like it. So I think I'm gonna keep it. And for the wheels, Endo V1s, they look insane. They look insane. I'm going for Endos. I, I know I've been doing Endos a little bit more recently. I don't have an excuse for it. I'm, I'm just, that's just kind of what I'm going with. So do you have that? We could do them in like a frost white. That could be kind of cool. That could be cool. We could also go black. The black steel looks crazy. I do like it with the primary color. I think it does look really good. I know everyone's sick of me going for black steel. I've seen the comments. Don't worry. I'm really tempted to go black steel. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to throw it on quickly. We're going to we're gonna see what we can do. Uh, bulletproof ties. I don't really need them, but I will just because why not? Yeah, let's do it. Uh, we could also go for a tire design today. I actually don't mind the look of it. Um, it does add an atomic logo, which we already have. So let's actually go custom tires for once. I like that. And then for the windows, I could tint them out slightly. It is a race car, but having having a little tint on the windows, that's that couldn't be too bad. It couldn't be too bad. Let's do a, just a light tint, light light smoke. Okay, I wish I could zoom this out. It's like really zoomed in in here. But I do feel like this looks quite good. I'm just wondering about the color of the car i'm wondering if there's something we could go for that would look a little better man i just don't know like i i feel like it looks really good i should probably just exit the custom shop now before i make a mistake but there's something about it that's just not quite there for me I'm wondering what it is exactly i do like the black flash livery i will i will just say that the stoplight racer graphics also is a super super cool livery for this car and it is really tempting me. Except I don't like how the Bravado Racing goes straight through the logo there. So I'm actually going to not do that. Oh, it does on this one too. Oh dear. Oh dear. Um, do I hope they don't notice that? I don't know. I feel like that's like that's not a good idea. Oh, it also goes through this logo too. That's crazy. That's like criminal. Maybe I should change that. Maybe I should change that. Maybe we should go for a Black Flash livery instead. I just Okay, I'm going to try this. I'm going to try this. Black Flash primary color red of some sort i haven't done a red car for like so long almost tempted to steal an npc customization uh color you know what i might just go cabernet red i'm gonna go cabernet red okay wait i'm gonna scroll up here on cabernet red for the secondary okay wait a second okay okay hey hang on hang on now we're gonna go with a candy red pearlescent on the Cabernet Red. Okay, nice. That livery is really not showing up very well. I'm not gonna lie, that that shit is not showing up. Cause the black flash, like I don't really think you can actually see it very well. But then again, I have gone for like a full race build. So I feel like I do need a livery option. Maybe I keep the black flash, I guess, I don't know. I do really like the stoplight racer graphic though. I really do like that, but I hate how it goes through two logos. I don't know what to do, guys. I don't know what to do. I feel like a lot of you are probably screaming at the screen right now saying, go back, go back. Okay, let me change the wheel color. Let's make that black now. Let's also, ah, there it is. Remove the tire design, okay. Honestly, I think it looks good. Let's, let's, let's go outside quickly and see can we see the livery in the sun? Oh, in the sunlight? Okay, you can actually see the livery quite easily. So I do like that. Okay, okay. Next thing I was gonna do is go to the Arena War Workshop and put some yellow headlights on this thing so that it's like race, like spec. Oh yeah, it, it, it looks like a race car, I feel like. I feel like the Harbor Blue with that other livery would actually fit a lot better, but the logo thing with that livery really pisses me off so i don't think we can do it let's see is anyone here nobody's here hello hello twongo how are you good how are you oh doing nice nice i really like this car that looks really cool i like it pretty sweet very nice yeah very liveries very nice. were pretty cool i don't remember seeing most of those yeah the liveries were pretty cool Oh, I had yours on for a little bit while I was doing it. Yeah, I had a different one on the whole time I was doing it, but then I changed because uh, I didn't know how to feel about it, so. Yeah. Yeah, the liveries are hard on this car, actually. I don't, I didn't quite a little know bit. There's to do. There's a few duplicate color ones, but yeah. yeah. <laughs> I do like your livery, though. I feel like that fits your car very nicely. 
pretty cool. It is. Yeah. It is pretty cool. Very neat. Excellent. Well, now the long wait. Oh, yeah. Got a lot of time ahead of us. A lot of time. A lot of time. He better come up with some shit that makes my jaw drop right now, bro. It's been 10 minutes. Oh, he definitely will. He knows how to do that. Wow. <gasps> oh, there he is. No way. Oh, oh man. Hmm. Okay. What? Who's that in the green? It's Twingo in the green. Yup. Okay. Who's that in the green? <laughs> it's NPC. <laughs> with a little hard art in it too. Ten cool. additional minutes to come up with a green car that's the exact same as <laughs> Twingo's. <laughs> it's, not... it's not the exact same, but it's pretty <laughs> close, man. Oh it's man. The, at least they're not the same shade of green. Like they're pretty different. Thank they, God, yeah. Yeah, they are pretty different. Okay. Well. Well, I'd say it's observatory time. Um, I'm up first, Ugh. and uh, I have mine in a dark green with a racing green secondary color. Um, and then my trim color is an olive green, which changed the seats, and then I changed the seats anyway to to be these like tuner seats with the green belts, seat belts, uh, to match with it. Um, for my front bumper, I have. The tuner one? I don't know. I don't know what this is called. It's it's not like the super, super big front splitter, but I wanted it to match with my wing here in the back, which is uh, I th the second most aggressive wing. Because um, the, the last one had some carbon on the back, or some chrome on the back, and I didn't like that. And I took off the lip so that this one could uh, shine through a little bit more. I went with the sport girts, which filled out the back end behind the front wheel, and then... Uh, was also not completely carbon. I went with the bolt-on arches, which had the stock hood, but had the bolt-on arches um, to match with the aggressive look. I've got the green mariachi bobblehead to match with uh, the green, of course. And then I I think this is the stoplight racer livery. It is. And um, mm. twin carbon can exhausts. And I think that is about it. Oh, and black loser rims from the sport category. Mm. Ooh. Cool. Interesting. Yeah. yeah. Can you pop the hood? Yes, I can. Awesome. I can't wait to see 2016. Oh, wow. yes. There it is. <laughs> it looks so bad. Beautiful. It's not as bad as the stock one, actually, so that's good. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. All right, let's talk about this bad boy yes, green let's talk over about here. Which one? Oh, yeah. A little bit different. It's a olive green. A regular olive green, no pearl lesson. Same for the secondary. Got it nice and flat. Got the same livery as NPC. And we did do uh, the rest, I think, are switched up besides the back. A little bit in the back. We did the same spoiler, but we kept the stock ducktail that came with the 900R because I went for something very aggressive, total time attack kind of thing. Uh, same exhaust. The diffuser is a little different because of the spoiler, which is cool. Me and NPC both have that. I like that about it. We did the deriveted body kit on the front and the back, like except it. we do have some on the skirts that are add-ons down there. And the front is another, I think it's the most aggressive, uh, second, second from the most bottom. aggressive. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't like the, um, the lights that they put in the bumper behind the canards there. So didn't do that. Went with the tropos track wheels, I believe in a dark copper, got a little bit of white lettering on them to match with the livery too. Did a, dark smoke for the windows there I believe that's it for outside let's open the doors oh yes all of them bam check out that interior oh. too got the full d weighted interior got a lot of uh, switches and buttons in the middle looks awesome wheels cool got the red seats red belts and polished valve covers titanium strut brace that's uh that's pretty much it i believe uh, NPC, you want to open your nice. interior, sir? Yeah. Ooh. Good to not see paddle shifters. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, I made sure. Yeah, me Yeah, too. mostly just carbon on the interior. Yeah. Neat. Nice. Right. Let's talk about on this bad up, boy. Uh, a blast. All right. Uh, I have gone for a Cabernet Red with a candy red pearlescent on it. Uh, I've gone for black wheels. Uh, these are Mercy's, or no, sorry, not Mercy's, Endos from the sport category. I thought that they fit very well in this car, actually. Um, I've gone for the black, whatever that, I think it's black stripe or something livery. I don't know, something like that. 
I went for the most aggressive front bumper option that I could. I also matched up with the skirts and did the same ones that Twingo did, I do believe, uh, because so. they stick out and they kind of fill out the uh, the rest of the uh, wide body kit on the car. So I like that. I went for the sort of stock Banshee spoiler, like the, well, I don't know what it would be, like a manufacturer spoiler, I guess. Uh, I kept the duck tail because I, I like the look of the car, like with the, the slope up that the that the ducktail kind of mm. provides even with the spoiler i think that it looks pretty good yeah so i went with that I went for the single exit exhaust because i was kind of going for a race car and i didn't want dual exhausts because that's just more weight for no reason so i went for the single exit exhaust um, i think it looks pretty good and then for the interior um, so for the for the engine i went for the uh, the carbon covers and then i went for i think the same strut brace that twingo has actually uh, for the seats, I went for some sort of a red. I think it's Cabernet Red, actually. I'm pretty sure. Those seats look crazy. It's like pomegranate red. Yeah. 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 That's oh, nice. It's, it's a very deep red. Kind of neat. Yeah. So. Um, cool. I think, very cool. Yeah. I just want to say, I, I just feel like this car it doesn't have the customization it once felt like it had. So that's it's unfortunate. It, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I think there's still uh, good looking off. options. Uh, so. I went for the vented hood as well. Um, vented hood. I, li yeah. I like the little tiny inlets there. I I, I didn't want the. Uh, I, I like Ooh. like the mostly smooth sort of look, uh, but then with a couple couple little inlets. So I think, uh -huh. it's, I think it's cool. Like oh, it. and then like and then it. and then yellow headlights because it's a race car. I thought that uh, was cool. So. Uh huh. Yeah. So yeah, that's, uh, you took that to the uh, arena workshop for yeah, that. I did, I did indeed. That is pretty cool. I did not, but mine are still like t they're not xenons. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's as cool as yellow as they're gonna get. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Oh yeah. Very cool. Um, cool. Well, it's time. It is time. Oh, and, and it is time. I, I want to start off with uh, with Mr. Twingo's car. What about Why it? Why do you have a red interior? Red interior looks awesome. I think also got red calipers. Red and green are complementary, so they do fit together. It's it's not. I don't know. I, like part of me thinks it stands out so much, and then the other part of me thinks it's like it's like a crocodile. I like, think it's a dark its enough red that it's not like yeah, it's burning, not, it's, but yeah. it's cool because it matches with a bit of the livery, like the badge, or maybe that's just a badge up front, and then the tow hook, and then the brake calipers, the lights in the back. I think it has just enough red to fit the seats and red seats look awesome so yeah red seats do look nice they do on a red car i think i think they look i think i actually think they look really good on Twingo's car i'm not gonna lie i i think i like it looks like a crocodile from my angle i i can i can see what you're saying i i don't think it's like the best fit ever but i also it's like you know red interior i'd have a red interior on any car i don't care what color it is it could be yellow it could be mcdonald's i don't care it, red interior is so sick no matter what i think mm. As long as it's not too red. If it's like Torino, yeah, like that's super bad. Super bright and yeah. takes away. Okay. But, yeah. but if it's like a darker red, I feel like it's okay. I'm convinced. Yeah. Okay. I, nice. I, I like it. Um, I like the tropos on the Banshee. I didn't think that I would. I think they're pretty they, cool. Yeah, I think they're, they're like, actually they're really just cool. the right thickness for the smokes for the spokes. Yeah. They're not like muscle car wheels. Mm -hmm. So I think they're they fit pretty well for this one. I do like. They that. look less sporty than I anticipated them to look. Which is a good thing, I think. Like they're sporty, but not like overly sporty, you know. They're kind of old, older looking sort of sporty. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I I like it. I um, like it. something I want to call both of you guys out on is the uh, that lip in the back. I I agree with the body shape thing, but I think it's kind of like a one step back, two steps forward when you take it off. It looks completely naked without it. I'm not. Yeah. But it has a spoiler. It has a spoiler. It, it, it's still the back like of the car. It flows with the build. No, but it slopes down in the back, and I think it looks really funny from the side. because It kind of like, just stops. You're, yeah, like, you, right your there. car comes up, up. It's perfect. It's level. It's level. And then all of a sudden, it just falls off in the back. It's, it looks like it has a receding hairline. It in the does. Back. Yeah, it looks like it's got a receding <laughs> hairline. That's exactly what it looks like. <laughs> I can kind of see it, Loki. It, it I also. Just, I didn't think it looked as good with like. It looks like you've like two spoilers. I don't know. I, yeah, I know. Like, I know. No I, I get for, what you... for this carbon wing. There's just enough. It's for just it's yeah. I, I think. Right I, I mean, it's just double down for us, really. So yeah. yeah. That's just how she how she goes, I guess. Uh -huh. It kind of is like a chick with huge to no ass. <laughs> Which one? Yours uh, or not yours? NPCs. Oh yeah. 
I see. Party in the front, nothing I see. in the back. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Yeah. Sorry, buds. Yeah, there's, there's one that you need. Okay. I, yeah. I can see it. You see yeah. what I'm so saying? Snipers always kind of have that little. Yeah, they do. Back, they so do. It's, yeah. It's like a signature. I mean, I mean, it does. To be fair, your card does like at the very end. It just like comes up a little bit. She's got. She's got like a eighty twenty ratio. Oh. Not yeah. good. It's not good. It's not Maybe good, brother. It's a pretty 80, small. Yeah, Ninety here. ten. Maybe yeah. Yeah. Five. Ni Ninety five five. Yeah. It's not. Yeah. It's one of those type of things. Yeah. Damn. Yeah, um, I mean, I do see your points a little bit. It is quite I, yeah, long. I, 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 I did, think if they yeah. cut it in half, that yeah, would be perfect. Yeah, if it was in half, I think it would be perfect. Yeah, I'd rather I have do, it than not have I'd it. Rather, exactly. I'd rather have it than not, than not have it. Keep it on me. Or, get, I keep that yeah. thing on me. Get caught with, Rather get caught with it than without it, as yeah. they say. That type of thing. Yeah. So anyway, okay, for sure. Yeah, valid. definitely. Anyways, for sure. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I do have to I... say about Harm mm -hmm. car because mm -hmm. I do like the livery, but what made me change it was all the different colors on it, especially the yeah, bright green I... and blues. Totally. I feel oh, yeah, like it just the really rainbow going doesn't on. fit with lots of different colors too, so it's not exactly your fault, but I feel like it could I feel like it could look great with that two tone black kind of thing. I yeah, I disagree. I could I don't see like it. that one. But I think I think the the smoothness on his hood with this like hood option is is pretty crazy. I I think it's a really good looking combo. Um, I'm I, a huge fan of the smooth hood. I feel like it's really like bulbous, almost like a pear shape. I, I the yeah. wheels come out a little long. I kind of like how the vents kind of like split it up a little bit. Yeah, I can see what you're saying. I, I don't know. I kind of I kind of like it. Kind of reminds me of an RX-7 a little more with this hood on it, which I I kind of like. Even though it is, I know it's a Viper, but it, people used to say this was the RX-7 in GTA because we didn't have one. So yeah, um, I see. I I can I can see what you're saying. Uh, for bit. the livery, I think because this bravado is so big and bright in the back, like above the back rim, I think it kind of like. It gets like I almost don't see the the other colors. Like I didn't really notice it till you pointed it out. Like it's bright, and I think it's okay to have some detail on the side of the card, but it's not as bright as that back one, which uh, matches the most. Mm -hmm. I think it looks pretty good personally. Okay, thank you, thank you. Well, I have a huge rose for both of you because mm -hmm. you both picked the same livery. Yeah, well, this that's a good looking great. livery. It is it's a good. It, it's a great looking livery. I almost chose it, in fact, but then I noticed one really big glaring issue do you see the bravado logo on the front of the car here and how yeah. the livery goes directly through it yeah but it's it's um um yeah uh, uh, uh um what's the word i'm looking for it's so got symmetry ugly. it's got symmetry with the v bro it's it goes right in between that, that is orange. so hideous that is so hideous and then not That's only not hideous, it's like built in not only once but twice because actually three times because on the side the liver goes through the Banshee logo that is on the side of the car, and I think it looks really stupid. Not like you can't read it, though. Yeah, you can it, definitely read it, but it looks really bad. It's not that bad. Dude, it is bad. That is bad, the bro. The front looks definitely the worst, but the it's, yeah, the it's front pretty is ignorable, the worst. I think. Uh, man, I don't know. I think once you notice it, you can't really unnotice it. Like, it's one of those things that's just going to keep you up at night, you know? It's like... <laughs> yeah, it's I like, think the pros outweigh the I cons, though, because the, yeah, the wings on the side mm. look amazing. It looks so cool. It's, like, pretty much all white, too, so it's just adding another color if you want a bit more depth. Yeah. If it just didn't have that Bravado logo and that stripe was a little bit lower, it would get a complete pass. But It would be perfect like that, yeah. It, it, it is it is a mess up and it and a lot of the logos have it which is exactly why i picked that livery option because it does not intersect with anything so, okay nega chin i i like it i like it also want to say uh your front bumper mm -hmm. is way too weak for the spoiler you have yeah you think i i don't like the other one personally or i didn't in the shop i think it looks better out in person than uh than it did in benny's I, cause I don't, I don't hate it. It, part of me thinks it's like, it's so massive. Like your car in particular looks like Crimson Shin from the Fairly Oh, it does. A hundred percent. Like, like it's got the yellow eyes and everything. Yeah. Your um, car. I'm not saying it looks bad, but like, I don't know. I guess in the, in the shop, I didn't think it looked nearly as nice. Um, yeah. They're not really It's just a crazy, 
it's a crazy size. It, it is, but it's, you know, it's a time attack vehicle. Um, I will also just say, uh, have you seen Iron Man 1? When I was like eight. You remember the first Iron Man suit? The first no. one built in the cave? The, the one built in the cave that the yeah. dude steals? Yeah. No. Front of your car, it's that. It's the face of that of that Iron Man suit. I see it, the mouth, it fits. That, yep. I it's, feel like that vent oh. right at the top of the bumper somewhere on the it, suit yeah, too. It is too. Yes, there's like an extra hole in the face yeah. of the suit. I think I think you're exactly right. I'm not okay, a well, fan Iron of that Man's vent sick. there. I don't know where it goes to either. Uh, it's just silly. People like Iron Man. No, people like Iron Man. I just think it looks, people ridic love Iron it, it looks ridiculous on a car. <laughs> what do you mean? They're both machines, no? Oh I think it's pretty sick. Cope. Yeah, no, it's Cope because I don't like that van right there. I actually didn't notice that until we got here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, Iron Man. I think the bobbleheads are really cool to touch, though, especially with the seatbelts. Yeah, I actually I actually like the bobblehead. I will give you that. Everything else is horrible, but... Yeah, okay. everything sucks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, but yeah, so your car is Iron Man with logos that go through logos and block them. And uh, your car is... That Iron Man, the crocodile, and I also, Chin. I also want to say I, I like Twingo's green a lot better than I like your green. I'm sorry. Really? I, and for the guy who's about to comment and say, Iron Man police NPC. <laughs> tell NPC to choose different colors, I guess. Okay. A well, different color today. You are pretty biased towards olive green. I know you've made I love several, olive green. many olive yes. green builds. Uh, it's a great color. It is a great color. It's... This... It's not not bad. It's I'm not the biggest a, fan of olive green. It's an acquired taste, I'm telling you. Once you think, go once you go olive, you never go in, dull, in in a deeper green, darker green. I I don't I don't necessarily dislike your green. I actually it, it, see okay, this is the thing. If your car was the green that it is and Twingo didn't choose olive green, I would probably like it. But in comparison, because they're both green vipers with a lot of the same customization options, I just think that Twingo's looks a lot better. Just my humble opinion. Again, for the guy who's about to say that I'm racist towards NPC somehow or something, I don't know. I don't know what <laughs> to tell you. The greens in this about. game aren't great looking. No, the I greens mean. do suck. This one's so dark, and I feel like if they desaturated it a little bit, it would look great. Yeah. We need more green options. Just just we for need, green. Yeah, just, yeah, serious. Come on now. They're all really not that great, except for olive green. Olive green yeah, is olive the only good one. Yeah, olive green is the winner. Mm. Olive green is the only good green in this game. I think... The olive green does look pretty sick in your car. I still like my green though. I, I no, I like your green too. I just like the olive green better. But that that could okay. be a personal bias too. You you not you're not exactly wrong. I also really like the bronze rims. Like olive green and bronze rims is like. I it's it's Dark a copper, pretty nice combo, but bronze. it's just copper, I think it's kind of. Like, I think maybe it's overused just because I've seen you use it so many times. It looks so good though. Oh, it looks so good, bro. I don't know. It's just it's so clean. Like I don't know. I like it I think a lot. The white lettering looks sick on it too. I I actually I, I the will, white does look really nice. On I it. will say I actually like the use of the oozers on your car though. I actually feel like those work quite well. And Thank I you. will actually say I like the oozers a lot better than the tropos. Ooh, the tropos I do like them. I just think that they they're like a little too old for the car. I think I will I think just they say are that. Too, they're definitely from an older era. But they definitely are. Yeah. I mean, it is an older. I think if they were Viper. released this year with Vipers, maybe they could be pretty nice. Yeah, totally. I just think it's an old. Well, I mean, it is off the Tropos Rally. That's where they get those wheels. So yes. that is a much older car. I do think it looks. It looks. It looks all right. It's. It, it's like good. You know. It's. It's okay. But I think the Uzus actually look really good. Thank you. You're welcome, mm -hmm. NPC. I think the Tropos are just a little too dished for this car. Like. Like, I think you need something dished because there's like the, the S racers, which is basically the oozers, but protruding. And that's a little too much. But like, I, I don't know. Can you see the cavity in like Twingo's rims? I, I, I can. Compared to I, our rims. I can. Yours are also dished though. They're, they're dished, but they come out a little more. They do come out a little bit more. I'm not a huge fan of this style of wheel. Maybe it's just me, but it kind of reminds me of like a spider because its legs are like kind of creeping up a they little does. bit. Yeah, I, I like how yeah. these ones were a little flatter. I think I think I think both of them look pretty good. They're, I think they they definitely do look good on both. Yours is more of a higher end wheel. I think mine was a bit more mid tier. Yeah, yeah, I would say I would say yours just like the dollar store like cheaper ramp. Not, not no, dollar not store. garage sale. Garage sale is what I meant. God. 
You bought them at a garage sale and they just happen to fit on your Dodge Viper and you're like, yep, let's do it. They look better than that. Eh. The, the more the more I envision it, the more I can see it. It's like some you went to some old geezer like Dodge fan's house or some shit and like bought some. These are rare weird... wheels. They're perfect condition from 1980. They're yeah, amazing. Exactly. Collector shit. Know. They're all right. The more They're all right. The more I look at your uh, red interior, the more I like it with the green. Because mm -hmm. I'm just thinking of like, it's just a crocodile opening its mouth. Like I'll, I'll do a side by side image right here. But then the more I look at your rims, the less I like them. Oh, I just think things. Tropos, Tropos rims look good. Um, but combined with the uh, the Banshee, not sure that that it is the best fit. I, and then I, I, I think do, I do agree with that. But I, I think they look okay. I think they look sick. We yeah, all just like have bad. different visions. Not bad. I'm not yeah, sure how I feel okay. about the Endos. Those are suck my f no. <laughs> they're Japanese on an American car, and, and yeah. I, they do look good. They're just a, they're a little basic for this. I feel like it needed a little more. Yeah, I think you can put that. On. I, don't, I don't know. I don't think it's the worst looking. Like at first, I was a little hesitant because it's just like it's just Endos, you know. But I think his car looks so tunery. Exactly. Like it's it looks like an RX-7. It does right? look a lot like it, an RX-7. It looks actually. like an RX-7. <laughs> Um, from from like the side and everything, from like the maybe from the front sort yeah, of angle. No, it's, it's actually yeah, it looks quite a bit like a ZR350. It's a very large yeah, RX7. It's very um, large, especially on the front, but it's not not bad. I personally like the cleanliness of it. Thank you. God bless you. Nice. Cool. Well, well, I'm done. Uh, I'm done talking I'm done about as your well. cars. I think it's time to race. It is time to race. Agreed. Well, there you have it. NPC does. I'm just a fan trying to take Whoa, a picture with my launch. favorite YouTuber. Yeah. What? He's cheating, bro. I swear Why to God. Why are you cheating? Last few races, it's just so obvious that NPC is cheating. Oh my God. What the hell talking about. is that, bro? Why I'm is my cooking. car on skates? Oh! oh. What Tropos the Both wheels are a little heavy. What is going on? Why is my car on skates? What is happening? Oh, Pass him on the inside, boom. Oh, oh yeah. Dude, how are you in first? Oh boy. Oh, I'm going behind. Oh, what oh. the hell? What? No. No way, bruh. Oh. Nope, that's a pole. Yes. Should hit it harder Damn. next time. What's oh going man. On? Bro, the 900R is bad. It is yeah, not good. It's, it's not a good it car. Sucks. I remember I racing this thing for the it. first time, and it was awful. I remember that like vividly. It was at the airport. I think I was with you actually, Aaron. I think this was in like 2016. Really? The nine? I think this car was out when I. Yeah, when it, I was, joined it was out because it came out with the Sultan, and that was the first car you ever saw me in. But it was out before I started playing. Is what I'm saying. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but we we had we had gotten uh, money at the airport ah. from from our buddy there, from our buddy way back in 2016. Oh no 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 no, no! He was just a random dude that we played with. Oh. It was it was some random modder guy was dropping money for oh. everyone at the airport. Oh, I love. Not that, that we took it because we definitely didn't for sure. Right, yeah. Rockstar. If you're listening, no one, we no one takes. We would not do that. Takes modded money. No one. I reported it as soon as it went into my account. Of sure. course. It's totally not why I may or may not have got banned back <laughs> in the day. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Uh, Dude, slip. How is that pole repaired? Slipstream is cruel. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. Let's go. Jesus Christ! Yeah, slipstream is cruel. I hope it doesn't affect you negatively on the top of that hill. No, 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 no! Oh! Come on! Last lap! Here we go! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Whoa there, pal! Whoa there, Don't pal. crash! Whoa! Oh, of course, of you. course, that was that literally was you, you, bruh. Me. 
Now you Bruh, me. do not play that. Oh my god, you, you cheat me. every time. Me cheating? Oh no, the viewers can see. They can. I'll oh, do six that. takes in my video this time. Yeah, I'll I'll do I'll do twenty in mine. How about that? <laughs> Go for it, I'll, buddy. I'll see what you did. Oh no! Yes. No, my lead. No. No, bro. Don't get passed up, buddy. Oh uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We'll see how long that lasts. Oh my God, you're kidding. Come on! You yes! rat! You yes! are such a yes! rat! Yes! You are such a rat, bro. Yes! Oh my oh, god, dude. We got, him. we got him. First place again for NPC. Let's dude. go. Yes! Damn, best lap by four seconds. Four seconds! Yes, sir. That's ten votes for me. Thank god, bro. God. Oh. Jesus. Okay, and then who do I want to take? I don't know. I'm I'm 0 for 3 right now. I don't know who to take from. Yeah, I'm gonna take from Harmon. Nice. I'm gonna take from Harmon because that's how that's how the the double colors usually work. One person gets all the votes, and so uh, I'm kind of expecting. It's fine by me. Give Twingo the win. <sighs> yeah, well, I've only me. taken from the winner. So there you go. All right. Cool. I, I get my votes minus, but I do yep. get 10 more. So yep. that's good. Those are our builds. Make sure you guys vote in the pinned comment down below. Now, if the pinned comment isn't there, somebody make one, do vote here and then reply to it. Say harm none NPC Twingo as three separate comments. Like the corresponding comment for who you think deserves to win. You can vote for multiple comments. You can vote for all three of us if you want to as well. So just make sure you guys vote. If you enjoy the video, a like is of course appreciated. If not dislike, Subscribe to my channel if you guys are new. Make sure you go and check out NPC and Twingo as well. And we will see you in the next video. Until then, take care. Peace.